it's Megan. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. So today's video is actually super exciting because it is a requested video by Happy Camper. So Happy Camper requested that I do an overalls lookbook from my um, denim lookbook, like my denim how to style. So today's video is going to be a how to style um, denim overall shorts. So I hope that you guys enjoy it and let's just go ahead and Alright guys, so it. here is the first look. So for this look, this is basically how I would typically wear um, my overalls. I like to kind of slouch them off one shoulder and you can wear these a lot of different ways when it comes to how you have them up here. But I usually like to wear like some sort of t-shirt. So here I went with a graphic tee that says pizza. This is from Forever 21. The overalls that I'll be showing in this lookbook are from Rue 21. So we've got like a more, I don't know, I guess kind of like skater street vibes, I guess. Um, so then I paired it with my fossil watch. This little choker from Rue 21. Um, little black and silver earrings from Francesca's. We have a bandana from Kmart, couldn't remember. And then for the shoes, I paired them with these little sneakers. These are from, hello, these are from Rue 21 also. Wow, that was like really difficult. Oh, and then um, my black bralette is also from Rue 21. So here is the first look, let's move on to the next one. Alright, so here's the next outfit. So basically everything is pretty much the same. We've got the bandana, choker, um, even the same sneakers. The only thing that I changed was the top. So I put on this little cute, um, like a salmon pinkish colored cropped hoodie from Rue 21. Um, and this would be like a nice outfit for, you know, if it was like a little bit chillier at night, but not cold enough that you really needed to wear pants, like a coldish summer evening or something like that. Let me just kind of stand up so you guys can see it. My head's going to cut out, but so this is what it looks like. I think this is super cute because it's got like the cute little sporty stripes and it's just a cool mix of, I don't know, like edginess because you've got like the rips and the denim and you've got like the little sportiness of it. So I think this is a super cute, sporty, sporty outfit. <laughs> that kind of hurt my leg. All right, let's move on into right, the so next this outfit. outfit. Again, we've got a graphic um, top. So this is just a little crop top that says Friday. Now, I feel like crop tops are super popular with um, overalls and that kind of thing. Personally, I'm going to show you guys definitely quite a few crop tops. Well, not maybe not quite a few, but I'm going to show you a few. It's not my typical style or like what I would wear a crop top with because I'm just not that comfortable in it and I'm not like super confident in it but I just wanted to try and appeal to some of your guys' style because obviously not everyone has the same style so I've got this little top like I said this is from Forever 21 but it was thrifted so I don't know if you can still find it then I've got my little Bastille baseball cap on and then I just have it paired with the same black sneakers so I feel like this is like kind of like a more cool um I don't know I don't know something about I guess I think it's cool but so what I did here is I actually unbuttoned it completely and I'm just letting it hang in the back because I feel like this is more of like a slouchy I think it's okay for it to be a little bit more slouchy because you've got the tighter smaller top on and then I also did tighten the straps as well because of the fact that it's a crop top so that I have less skin showing um, with something that like the cropped hoodie, I had them sagging down a little bit more or a full length shirt because I'm a little bit more comfortable that way. So like I said, just kind of depends on your preference, but this is this outfit. So let's move on to the next one. All right. So for this outfit, I kind of wanted to go like more like 90s retro kind of vibe. So I've got, like I said, you know, the same choker, but this time we've got a little cropped t-shirt that actually is tie dye on the sides. And I love this. I think it's just a really cute, like it reminds me of something that you would have worn as a kid, which is like super in right now. So I really, really like the look of this. Um, I think it would maybe look a little bit better with a different wash of overalls, just because I feel like it does blend in a little bit with my shirt, but it is what it is. And then this time I actually paired it 
with some white sneakers. These just have a rose gold stripe on them. The top and the sneakers are both from Forever 21. I'll have anything that I can find um, linked down below for you guys as well. So that is this outfit. So let's move on to the next one. All right, you guys, so here is the next outfit. Now I know this one looks a little bit wonky, but I've seen this done before and I wanted to try it and see if I could make an outfit out of it that I actually didn't hate. And I definitely don't hate this. It is a little bit strange looking, but then again, I kind of like it. It's a little bit, I don't know, it's very like fashionable and edgy in a way because it's not the way that this piece of clothing is typically designed for. But basically what I did is I actually folded down. Let me see if I can try and get up a little bit so you can see. So you, if you can see, I actually folded down the overalls and then you can see they kind of like flap down in the back, which looks a little funny. So let me actually try and tuck that in. And then you have a weird bulge. So I guess it just kind of depends on what you want. If you want the bulge or if you want it sticking out. Um, it actually doesn't look terrible, but it's not that comfortable. So I would honestly probably just leave, pro blah, 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 probably just leave it like this. So then I paired it with this um, t-shirt that I have from Forever 21. I actually folded it up a little bit so it's a little bit more cropped. So you can show a little bit of skin here. And then I just paired it with a hat just to kind of give it that more like edgy, fun, cool look. And then again, I would just pair it with my little black sneakers. And I think that, that would really just tie the whole look together. So this is definitely, like I said, oh, and then what I did, so these are actually too big for me. I've lost weight since I bought these. So I can't just wear them like shorts without them falling straight off of my body. So what I did was I actually like tied them all up and like knotted the um, actual little straps together so that way they wouldn't fall down. So I don't know, it's different. I kind of like it though. So I don't know, it's not everybody's cup of tea. I probably wouldn't necessarily wear this out, but I don't hate this outfit, so maybe I would. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. <laughs> I almost just fell. All right, so this look is a little bit crazy, but I think it actually is super, would be really cool for um, like a photo shoot or something. So what I did was I actually took this black bodysuit from Rue 21 and I really, really like lengthened the straps as far as they could go because I wanted the strap off the shoulder a little bit so that you could see the bodysuit, but I didn't want it to be like really like lean forward and slouchy. I still wanted it to look a little bit more put together. So I actually just left it on my shoulder and then I also kind of slouched this one off my shoulder a little bit just so you can really see the bodysuit and you can see, you know, like how it hugs me and stuff. So I did loosen them so that the shorts go down farther since, um, you know, cause I'm like, let's be honest, these make me look a little bit wide. So pairing them with something a little bit tighter is a lot more flattering. And I just feel like it's a really cool twist on the on like overalls like you wouldn't necessarily expect them to be paired in like a sexy way like I feel it well I guess I don't want to say that but you wouldn't really expect them to be paired in more of like a yeah sexy we're just gonna go with that you wouldn't really expect them to be paired in more of like a sexy way, like with some, like a bodysuit or, you know, like should dress them up for a night out. So I really wanted to showcase how you could. So I think this is actually a super cute going out outfit. And then you could pair this depending on like where you were going with um, the black sneakers. Or I think this would look really cool with some black sock boots or even a pair of black heels, depending, like I said, on where you're going. But like I said, this I just feel like is very unexpected but I think I really like it like I just feel like it's super different but it's giving a really feminine twist on a piece of clothing that's not necessarily the most forgiving and the most flattering on a like a feminine body so like to the front I look kind of like chunky you know but then when turn to the side I don't look as chunky Ooh, that's classy just took that right in and then, oh, and then this um, bralette is also from Rue 21. This entire outfit is from Rue 21, so surprise, surprise. Anyway, let's move on to the next one. All right, you guys, so here is the next look. So this one is a little bit different. So I think that something that people don't normally think of would be to use your overalls as a swimsuit cover-up. 
I mean, look at how stinking cute this looks. And it's such an easy thing to just slip on over your swimsuit if you wanted to go, you know, like grab a bite to eat or like walk around a town or anything like that. And I just think it adds like a really cool detail. I think that the contrast of like your swimsuit against the denim looks really cool. And I'm sorry that this isn't like the most flattering swimsuit ever, but I couldn't find my, whoa, what's my hair doing? I couldn't find my favorite one. Um, I like what is happening like what is this what are you doing just stop <laughs> sorry but I couldn't find my favorite swimsuit um but I needed to film this so we're just dealing with it. like see how it like gaps weird right there but anyway um I got this from the VF store so and then obviously you would just pair this with whatever sandals you were wearing that day or anything like that but again I did the one shoulder just because I feel like you can still showcase your swimsuit and I just like the kind of slouchy look especially with like a swimsuit which is something meant to be like you know tight and cute and all that kind of thing so yeah there is that one all right so this outfit I wanted to show you guys how you could pair your overalls with a jacket so I've got on a long sleeve cropped uh, Wonder Woman t-shirt from Rue 21 um, and then I just threw this jacket over it. It's just like a little cropped Carhartt looking jacket that I thrifted. Um, and then I have my Bastille hat on. So what I did was I actually have both of the straps on, but I loosened this one to the point where it's kind of sagging down so you can see my top. Um, and then I just kind of put the crop jacket over it. You don't want a super long jacket with um, overalls because it's going to overpower your outfit unless you're wearing something very light and feminine, like maybe a duster or something like that. I think would look really cool but this is just kind of a I don't know I something about this outfit it's like very casual but still kind of it adds a cool like masculine touch to it so if that's more your style then I think that this would be um really fun for you and then obviously if you got a little bit chilly or something you could easily just throw on a little crop jacket or something on right over top and I kind of like the contrast because this is kind of like a denim so getting the denim on denim by having the black with the light wash of the overalls I think looks super duper cool. So that is this outfit. Let's Alright, so I also wanted to do a really sporty look. So what I have here is this little um, tank top, like hoodie tank top from Fabletics. Um, and then I have my Bastille head on again. So I wanted to go for a really like sporty look. I don't think I just said that, but anyway. Um, and then I actually wanted to pair it with my New Balance Fuel Court Coasts in what used to be white. I think this would be really cool for like if you were going somewhere, um, like maybe you were touristing and you wanted to be really comfortable or you were walking around or garage sailing or you know going shopping and you wanted something really cute and casual and comfortable but kind of sporty and almost a little bit edgy. I really like the strings hanging down and then I also did um, just the one shoulder this time, but I put it under my arm again, just so you could really get the full effect of my shirt, but you could easily, um, if you wanted to feel more secure, you could just do the two shoulders, and even here, you could do just like a little bit more of a slouchy, more of a slouchy, <laughs> you could make one shoulder slouchier than the other, kind of have it hanging off your arm or something like that, so... There is the sporty look. Okay guys, so here is the last outfit. So what I did here was, again, I've got one shoulder on, one off the shoulder. This time I tucked it underneath my arm, just so you could get a lot better view of my top. And then I actually, so this is a little velvet tank top that I got from Rue 21. And then I have this little necklace here. I think I actually got this from Goodwill. Um, so this would be like a going out look like this, you know, I would wear out where if I ever went out, but if I did, I would wear this. And then I think this would look super, super cute paired with some wedges or some heels because it's more obviously more of a summery look. Um, so I would do something like this, like a little booty kind of like it's like a little slip on booty or I would do a wedge something like this. I think that it would just really class out, class up the outfit. And I really wanted to showcase how you could dress up overalls because I don't think that that's something that people typically try to do or, you know, that they think that you can do. And I just wanted to show that you can because it's your clothes and you can do whatever the heck you want. So hopefully you guys like this outfit. So I just wanted to show that you guys can really do whatever the heck you want. So, that is this outfit. 
All right, you guys, so that was my overall styling lookbook. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below as well as hit the little bell notification. Also, make sure that you leave any comments down below about what was your favorite outfit. Would you wear any of these? Um, and then any requests for other videos that you guys would like to see from moi. And I will catch you guys on the flip side. Bye!